Hi everyone, welcome back to the Play Mining TV 81 recap and summary series. And on the episode, we have Misushi san, Olivia san, Malkun san, and Ajri Hurai san. So they talk about the results of the 7 PvP announcements of the prize winners. So, who the final challenger would look like, and the 8th challenger auction, uh, some information about championship broadcasting. Ajuhara and Sun's Corner and this new Job Tribes uh, scholarship announcement. So Malkun Sun is on the po was on the program, uh, so he got second place. So he has he had been playing for almost a year and he had slowly uh, level up each of the job lords. Have gotten them three stars. I think starting from uh, ground ground zero, but uh, I think he's also pretty much free to play as he didn't buy any NFT artworks before uh, but until he won or uh, had some uh, high level placings in the PvP event so he after that he bought some NFT using the deck coins so for Job Trash Championship you have the 8 contestants here which is Shinke-san, Rakuya-san, Nyonyo-san, Ajihure-san, Akuhure-san, Kanemori-san, Malkun san and the challenger so the challenger what the job tribes decided to do was to have uh, any of us any of the players to have rights to the pvp challenge so there'll be two tickets available per se so what uh, job tribes has done is that you can use 100,000 debt to purchase an opportunity so two people there'll be two people who can purchase this opportunity and then the two people will challenge and fight fight it out for the 8th place in the upcoming PvP Championships. So the lottery or the draw for the 8th contestants will happen on the 11th of August. And then there's the first and second half of the qualifying league and then the final tournament on the 25th August at 7pm. I think it's worthwhile to uh, tune in and have a look at the official Play Mining TV on what happened in the final tournament of the top players. The episodes also talk about the new art for PvP champion Aku Akari San. So very cute uh, art here. And the Water Som Somalia NFT art is going for half price. So it's a limited time sale, it's a water job lord. And also the this is the puzzle mining chain squad, uh, puzzle rangers, all grown up EK men squad. Uh, so the the illustration is on sale now. Uh, the Somalia, yep, as we talked about, it's half price. So instead of six thousand depth, it's going for three thousand depth. You know. And uh, it's the first two skills are one is to decrease the enemy's budget second and third is more to deal damage to single target enemies so the nft for this ek man uh, chain squad is going for 300 depth so play mining or job tribes has also collabed with the central the central land so there's an actually like a virtual property on the central land which is the job tribes of play mining office there uh, if you purchase this uh, ticket here uh, you get a chance to solve a puzzle and if you solve a puzzle in the central land you will be awarded this legendary phantom thief uh, nft so if you do have uh, coins in the central land or you do play the central land do go to minus 25 dot minus 116 this is the address for play mining at the central land to solve the puzzle but to be in the puzzle then you need to uh, purchase a ticket I think which will come up later in the next slide but if not you you need to purchase a ticket to uh, the central land which is around 5,000 depth so they also ask for videos for Pai Pipu Payday. So if you have a five set, if you have five seconds and you like to have do a short dance, just do a short dance, and uh, you can get awarded the job lot or the NFT that you want. So it's worthwhile joining, participating. These are the details, and it's a hot summer bid, so you can bid for all this NFT starting from one depth. 
and the Job Tribe Scholarship. So the scholarship, it's uh, it's more of uh, being able to at this stage rent out uh, rent out job lots, if I understand. Uh, so the the details will come later. So very high level preliminary is that for first place, it seems like they have. Uh, if you come in first place in the PvP championship, you have four slots which you can rent out your job lot. For example, if Shinke Sun comes up top in PvP, uh, he can rent out some of his job lots for uh, a price for a debt, uh, pay some debt, and uh, can rent uh, his uh, powerful job lots. So, like second place, maybe two job lots that can be rented out, so on and so forth. Uh, details will come in later, but I think they were trying to introduce this uh, rent or they call it scholarship uh, program. So uh, let's say if Shinke-san rents out the, his uh, job lot, I think both the renter and Shinke-san, for example, will earn that. I think that's, uh, that's the plan. So they will announce it in September. We will have more details. So it's uh, a, a lot of news for this episode. Thank you for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe to my channel and see you soon.